has said something that has uh, got Molimu thinking here. If you've not registered as a voter or your man has not registered as a voter, ladies, what you're supposed to do is deny him his conjugal rights and don't cook for him. Akio. To register. Muta register. You know, and um, it really got me thinking is that the worst form of punishment a woman can meet out? It works. Does it work? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Total Let me tell you something. Whenever you cosia your woman, that's the first thing to go. Mm, that's what they do. But does it work? Yes. If your wife cuts it off, guys, would that force you to register as a voter? They've done it and it has worked because before what we use a gorofa. That is the worst thing a woman can do to her man. Yes. Amazing. Ladies, I want to know if it's true. Does it work? Because everything you're being told, if he doesn't do this, deny. If he doesn't do this, deny. Every time you cosign, the first thing to go is that. Mm. And it has worked. I want to ask two questions this morning. Please. Is that the worst form of punishment a woman can meet out to her man? Number two, does it work? Has it worked for you? When she cut off the supply chain, turned off the tap of love. Mombasara, utauza gorofa. 0711-046-105 is my number. Give me a call. How powerful is shutting off that part of your life? And ladies, does it work? Why don't you give me a call if you want to contribute via SMS? My short code is double two four nine four, or hit me up on my fan page on Facebook or Twitter handle at it's my neck again. Hashtag M I T M minor in the morning. Follow that conversation at classic one hundred five dot com as well. Esther Borugi has said, "Cut off the conjugal rights if it does not register as a vote." That's the first thing to go. My question is: Is that the worst form of punishment to meet out to your man and ladies? Does it work? Patrick Nairaba, good morning. You're saying, man, let women understand it's suicidal to deny their men conjugal rights because the things men can do out there is shocking. Let them devise another way to punish their men. Otherwise, if only they could know what they do, they will die the next minute. Ah, Kyo. But how about this one? Hi, Maina, good morning. I agree 101% that it works. That's how I punish my man. Akikata kunifanyia kitu. Maina, let me tell you some of these men cannot live without it. That's the best form of punishment for the men. Kwanza wa sikuizi. Does it work? Lile? Hello, Marina. How are you? Good morning, darling. Good morning. Yes. Now, I want to educate women here. Yeah. Uh, there are people who are saying that denying a man conjugal rights as a, is, is a punishment to them. Eh? Yeah. I want to tell them they are stupid. Yeah. And they need to try luck. Simply because, eh? Yeah. You know, the moment you do that, you just... Sending him off to the next available customer representative. Yeah. <laughs> and she is so much ready to offer it to him. So, ah, mama, I told you, I'm going to go to the house. 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 He'll just move on to the next customer representative. Next customer representative. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. Okay. <laughs> there are so many who in there. All right. Okay. Thank you for <laughs> your. In the Meskia. Bye. 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 Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Okay. Does it work? Hello, Classic 105. Good morning. Hello. Uh, hello? Yeah, my name is Christy. Yeah. And uh, I just want to make a quick uh, contribution to this uh, topic. Yeah, go on. Um, I don't think it can work. You don't think it can work? It's the same thing. Have you tried it as a form of punishment? Yes, I did. And? And it all got back to me. How? He cheated on me. He cheated on you? Yes. It didn't, it didn't even go far with it on me with my house girl. With your house girl? Yes. Hiya. Yeah. Seriously. So it doesn't really work. He didn't even go far? He didn't even go far. He cheated me with my house girl. Eh. 
that was not enough. She cheated on me with my neighbor's child. With your neighbor's child? Yes. The girl was only in class eight. Yeah, she was only? The girl is, it was, but there was some things that was in class eight. She was in class eight? Yes. The guy was caught red headed in, in my neighbor's house with that girl. <laughs> what do you mean? Yes, I'm very serious, minor. It doesn't work, minor. And it, it, it will never work. Okay. Yeah, it's just like saying, because now um, uh, he has not done A, B, C, D, you're not going to cook for him. The thing is going to feel hungry. He can never feel hungry because you didn't cook for him. He will go to a restaurant and get something to eat. Come home, you go there, and looking hungry though, pretending that he's hungry, but in any sense he's not. He's already settled himself out somewhere else. Wow. I said something that has uh, gotten more with your uncle and your granny and everyone here at Classic 105 UK Santa. He's right. Is the equivalent of denying myself my pleasures. I can never do such a thing because I'll be hurting myself as well. Mm. These are two people things so women stop acting like men are the ones who enjoy. Does it work? Hello? Hello, my name is Nzuri This is not working at all. Uh-huh. Right now I'm in trouble uh-huh. because there's a time my wife denied me this thing. Yeah. And I tried it outside. Yeah. I'm telling you it is so sweet. I've tried to get out of it and up to date it's I can't. You're still with a woman out there? Not even one. Because the first time she tried she said no for like two weeks, I couldn't stand it. I went out. I got satisfied. The person I was with was an Indian. Ajay Rudi Kenya. I tried it another time with an Asian. It has never worked. I've never come back home. So every time she tried to say like, ish, 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 it's okay. See you tomorrow. I'll go out. You'll go out? Yes. And I can't get satisfied with her anymore. I used to love her, I used to stay with her, I used to enjoy every bit of it. But the moment she tried that nonsense, I tried it outside and I realized that there's some very hot soup, I mean sweet soup that is boiling outside my house. I've tried, I've tried praying over it, I've tried all the things I can to get out my inner. I think, I don't even think counseling will do it, but... I just want to tell the women out there who have not tried it, please don't, because you're just going to cause trouble in your marriage and you're going to put yourself in a mess. By the time you want to come back, when you want to bring this man home, he will never be there for you because you'll remain the same, same person and life will never be the same again. It is a stupid behavior. You will try it once, trying to to prove that you're a woman, but it is your weakest point. It is never a, a woman's strongest point again. Maybe it used to be during our grandmother's days and all those. But right now, sex is everywhere. It is not a, strong, a woman's stronghold again anymore. So it's your, it's, now it's, it's impossible for your wife to satisfy you? It is not. You must go... No matter what she does. No matter what she does. You must go out there. I must. Wow. And it started with her. When she said no for two weeks, I was to be, I used to be very faithful, very honest, do everything the way she wants. But the moment she allowed me to try it out, she spoiled everything. And it ended, and the, the, everything changed? Everything changed. She's still my wife. We still share the same bed. We have intercourse, but whatever, we just do it for the sake. I just do it for the sake. But I enjoy it outside than when I'm with her. Amazing. Many women will say it's stupid, but let me tell you, it's a fact. I warn you, don't try. Okay. Bye, bye, Maina. Bye, Maina. Guy, I think we need to pick up on that tomorrow. <laughs> what do you mean? No. Is there a lesson you're learning, girls? I Talk to me.
My name is Minas. Yes, Garana. Garana, yes. I happened to concur with the gentleman who had just spoken there. Yeah. yeah. I've just opened my head and I found him saying that women should not use uh, sex as a, as a tool. Yeah. And uh, I can tell you with certainty that my wife has tried the same thing. She tried it, uh-huh. And for the last eight years. Yeah. Do you know we've not even had sex with her? We live in the same house. For the last eight years? Eight, eight, eight years. We live in the same house. And you sleep on the same bed? No. I have a, uh, uh, fortunately, um, I have a big house. here, have my own bedroom and I have my bed. We are, in, uh, in, uh, we are going to 60 now, you see. Yeah. You're, going to but, s- you're going to 60 years old now? Uh, yes. But I get my phone outside, outside marriage, even, even during the time we were young. She tried to wrestle me, uh, I'm twisting, uh, using sex as, an object, uh, as a tool, you see? Yeah. But uh, I resisted. We had, a very, well, we had a very bad marriage, and let me tell you, we can own up. And to be brutally truthful to the uh, honest to the women, they should not use their bodies as, as, uh, as, as a weapon. As a weapon, yes, against men. So let me ask. Yes. So she's obviously getting some from outside as well. Do you? Is it no, that you she don't? Cannot get sex. She cannot get sex anywhere. What makes you say that? Well, well, well she, she's not that. She doesn't have that much money. She can buy sex from men, <laughs> young men. <laughs> Unfortunately. Eh? So you. So you're sure she's not getting any? She's not alive. No, no, no. You know what she did, eh? Uh, well, uh, she went to church. Eh? Yeah. That's where they know they go and hide. That's where they go and hide, you see. Although we have a very crazy pastor nowadays. <laughs> you know, we are, we are being uprooted all over. Yeah. Uh, but uh, I, I, in person, all those years, I've been having sex. Buying it, actually. It's usually buying it. If you want a good, juicy woman, I get it. I get her. I've got the resources. You've got the resources? Yeah, we, we use money. We use money, power, minor. If you have money, you, you can get sex from anybody. So sex not be used as a weapon by a woman. There are so many different women, good, good, good men all over the world, world over. And they all want money. They are hungry for money, they are craving for money. So I'm telling men out there to use their money power and yeah. get a young girl, an old woman, and so forth. So, so you, you're, you're not you're not intimate with her. You've not been for the last eight years. Yeah, not even eight years. For the last almost twenty. Eight years is not we've not had sex uh, even before then. She was using her body. Uh, my now we get sex from anywhere. Go to Lutuli Avenue there and you get sex during the day and night, twenty four hours. How, how is your relationship one on one? Is it okay? Well, we talk because we have children and we talk. We, we, we talk to you. Mainly we talk because I don't want to divorce. Mm. It, she's mine forever, but uh, we, there's nothing there. There's no love lost in <laughs> but, she, but she's yours forever. She's mine forever. I know well, 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 the women are the same. Mm. The, the writing is on the wall. Women are the same. They, 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 they have no color. You put any color you put them, they, they, are, they are that color. They have no color, women. Mm. <laughs> they are color like money. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Have a good day. Where? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell is that I just had? No, really. What the hell is that I just had? What can I get you? Hima Udo, my whiskey, please, double-double. Sir, sir, come in a moment. Have to f- close our discussion. What? Some mornings, you just need a little extra help to get you going. I'm changing it. Kenya's number one way to wake up. <laughs> Start your day with some fun. Classic 105. <laughs> Good thoughts for sad. Morning. Morning to you. Yes. Sometimes I, I, I listen to you in the morning and I just feel like pulling out my hair. <laughs> yes, so do I. <clears throat> you know, I'm, I'm just listening to that man who's just called and I'm thinking, he's laughing very happily. I had to with the minor. And he's saying, oh, this woman is mine. I know she's mine forever. Minor, there is no woman who is yours. It's just your turn. 
No, there is no man who is yours. It's just your turn. Yes. Eh. When you're getting it, it's just your turn. So for him to laugh and be very considerate about it, the way he's been getting it out there for eight years, who tells her he, he should not have been getting it? Eh. Then I'm ingenious. I mean, come on, you drop your wife back in the office at 8, 8 a.m., come pick her up at 5 p.m., or can you be accountable for the hours that you've not been together? No, you can't. So let people stop saying, uh, and we told you, that is, 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 I don't know, one thing or the It's nothing. You can get it anywhere, anytime. So it's just as simple as that. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, it's just as simple as, when do you want it and who do you want it from? So let, let people not start laying in here. She's mine and I know she can't go anywhere. <laughs> you, you don't know where people go. Or what they do the hours that you're not together. So a woman is not yours. It's just your time. When you care. Wow. Have a good one. Have a good one too. Hey. A woman is never yours. Yeah. It's just your turn. Akio. What? Akileo. Omo the. Chineke.